Yo! What's up guys? How y'all doing? Y'all already know who this is. <laughs> if y'all didn't know, y'all already can get to know. <clears throat> okay, y'all already know that I'm not 100% all here. Okay, I'm gonna let y'all know that I'm not all the way here, but I feel so good. Yes, I do. Um, uh, I, I have an, uh, actually, sorry about that. Okay, this video is entitled, To All the Men. In men, FTMs, trans men, uh, tomboys, bio boys, um, studs. This is entitled to all the dominant ones. This video is going to be comic because I'm in that type of mood right now. And then, but it's going to be honest and it's going to be blunt. And, but it's going to be real. But it's also going to be funny. Okay. Um, I'm going to entitle this video The Don't Dudes. Because a lot of y'all, studs and men, trans men, a lot of y'all don't know what you should do and a lot of y'all don't know what you should not do but <clears throat> there's a lot of things that we as men or dominant roles should do and not do first of all what you should not be what you if I guess I will break it down on two levels because you got your men and then you've got your studs and um, no offense studs but I can't put you in a category for trans men because they're men I can't put them with straight man and bio man, but I cannot put studs in that same category because you're a woman. Uh, for women, uh, if you're a dominant stud and you got a girlfriend, girlfriend, lover, companion, or whatever the deal is, and if she asks you this one question, and I know you films do it all the time, even straight women ask, do this make me look do not answer that question with a respond that will get you no play, no service, no business, no cutty cutty, no comfort, no drink, no money, or driving her car. Do not be too honest, meaning that if she says, do this make me look fat, say, it makes you look attractive. That's, I mean, look, or it makes you look sexy. You know, that no, you don't look fat, it makes you look sexy. Because a lot of y'all women, I hate that, say, does this make me look fat? That is a test. I think that is a test. A test to say, if she tell me I look fat, I don't have to sleep with her. I don't have to give him no play or her no play. And I don't know what they thinking about. Because I ain't finna do no cooking, no money. You think you can't drive my car. That's how it is. So, the answer to that is sometimes even don't say nothing. Nothing, saying, come here. Saying nothing works oh, real well. But if you're going to say something, say yeah, baby. It, it say no, baby. It makes you look sexy. You know what I'm saying? And it enhances your physique that I'm falling in love for. That way, you ain't got no problem. To the women of y'all fans asking, or straight women, stop asking that question. That makes us angry. That, that just sets us up. Alright. There's another one. For studs, do not sit up here and ask your girl about any of her past. Meaning that asking her what she did to please her girl. Her ex. Who cares? Or is that your ex? Who cares? Because you're setting yourself up. If she said, yeah, that's her ex, then you're going to be all upset. Or if her friend is her ex, you're going to be all upset. And then you're going to be crying and whining. Just like, a, no offense, a B. You're going to be crying and whining like a bee. Even to y'all guys, don't act like just because you wear the big man drawers. Y'all act like girls sometimes. Y'all act like you got a vagina. So get over it. Alright. To you, to you men. Stop 
This is what you should not do. Don't ever sit up here and talk about your past or what she used to do for you. And even that goes to you still. Don't ever talk about your pre your ex with your present. Because a lot of them women do not want to hear about your ex. Girlfriend, what they did to you, how they did it, what you liked about them, how they look, how they smell, what y'all did when y'all was together. Look here. Past is past and present is present. If you want to keep your present, don't talk about your past. You good. Alright. This is another thing men don't do. Don't sit up here and give some service to your girl business and expect her to give a whole lot more service to your business than you gave to hers. Meaning that if she pleases you for a long time, guess what you need to do? It's an equal equal. Don't sit up here and cut her short of her her uh you know her happiness when she didn't give you a lot to get your happiness equality is the best thing guys another thing when you sit up here buying drawers don't buy them white them whitey tighties don't don't do it I know y'all be in the Hanes section and you be like Hanes is the best price because it's cheap especially in Walmart don't act like y'all better if you gonna get some Hanes hey Hanes you see that? Hanks. They're boxes. Do that. Do that. But don't be walking around with hang whitey tidies that look like you walking around with notebook paper with a V. Uh uh. That's not cute. That's not sexy. No, nobody wants to see all that. Uh uh. Another thing. To the studs. If you're going to wear a white speeder, have a clean sports bra. Bam! have a clean sports bra that I mean it's not hard you can get it at Walmart you can get three in a bundle for like maybe about six bucks you can get a sports bra in every little color for about six bucks I don't want to see no more videos of y'all studs dancing and I see a sports bra that was white and it looked like it's got like it's got butter on on the on the, on the uh, on that little curve right there. You know what I'm saying? That little curve. I don't want to be seeing that. Looking like it's got a tan. Uh uh. That's not sexy. And if you got white speeders and they get that tan, up do your white speeders and your t-shirts. I don't want to be seeing your t-shirts look like they got tan overnight. Looking like my camera vision. You know how how brownish look? That's how some of y'all y'all be y'all I've been seeing. Stop it. To the guys. Wash your feet. Feet be smelling like hot Cheetos. Girls are telling me this. That's the that's the don't do. Do not do that. Do not be trying to put socks over your feet that look crusty. If you know you got long toenails, clip them. Do not sit up here and think your woman wants you to rub want some woman to rub your feet or suck on your feet and your toenails looking like like they didn't grew overnight looking like Chewbacca nails that's not sexy that's not sexy uh uh also if you know men I don't trim your hair under your arm trim it, it it's, it's great you don't need to be walking around like you Chewbacca I mean with long hair all here and running down to your chest you got chin chest you got chin chest hair that's not cute. That's not even attractive. I don't even know what that is, but it's not. And some of y'all studs, keep, if you're going to have sideburns, groom them up. Groom them up. You know what I'm saying? I, that's all I got to say. Keep your hair groomed up. Some of y'all walk out, look like, what the heck? That ain't cute. Women are telling me this. Women are telling me this. So studs and men, tighten up your game. Because if you tighten up your game, Sometimes you can get in there. Ooh. You know what I'm saying? So that's what that is. Not trying to be a hard brother, but you know what I'm saying. This your man Kumari. I was keeping it funny, funny. This is what the don't do's for the studs and the men. Peace.